effects. And you can do this. Okay, guys, I have everything ready. I am going to make a new video. So please, sabar kara, sabar kara, sabar whatever. Drop the link for the download so you don't need to find everything by yourself. Now, just follow me. Right click, make solid color, black one, and call it back ground. Then move it down and crop it. I don't know how long you want to be, but like this is for me for the bits. Then move the rail like this and the dirt. Make dirt 3D, press R on your keyboard and move X rotation like me. Make it click, I don't know how you like it. Then click on dirt and make it. I just mask it with this. and I will pre-compose it and disable the adjustment composition duration because I don't need it so now add Gaussian blur and make it 50 10 or maybe 5 ok 5 looks good then I will add the train I will animate it from 70 to uh, yeah, looks good. Then let me see. Yeah, it's good. Then add curve supreme and make it like dark, maybe like something like this. Yeah. Okay. So now. Add the character. I have choose this one because I made the edit with that one. And now I will make light and call it shadow. You can copy my settings. I will make character 3D. Yeah, this looks good. Now we need opt the optical flares for the train. So I'm gonna make the new solid and call it optical flares. Uh, make it below the character. Add optical flares. Go to the settings and choose like whatever you want. I want this one. Okay, now I will press OK and I will change color. Yeah, now I like this one. Now right click on the solid color, blending mode, and select the screen or add. Now we need to animate the, the scale of the train, like from, from like this to. Settings. I will delete the scale 
and I will make it 3D. Uh, not 3D, I will, I will blend the mode to the screen. Then I'm gonna move it like there. Yeah, that's it, let me see now. That's too much, I just need to break it slower. I will copy that one, I will make it above the character, and I will move the, this weight. Wait, there, okay. So now I can fix the light because again, the character is too light. So I'm gonna just make this loader like this. Okay, that's good. <coughs> now we need to fix the rail because it's too bright for the everything, and I will just add pictures. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so now I will make again no solid. I will choose the gray color. Then I'm gonna put opacity to zero for now. And then I will choose the, the rectangle and make it there like this then opacity to 100 again so now I can make this make it smaller like maybe yeah let's do like this So I like it like this, then I will pre-compose it, make it 3D, make it below the train, then I'm gonna press L on my keyboard and move it the uh, like this. That's it, I think, yes, so I will pre-compose everything, disable this one, then I'm gonna add camera, like the D settings, you can copy mine but you don't need, drop it again, I will add the nulls, null object, then I'm gonna make video 3d I don't know how to see that. I don't really know what I so now I can press P for the position make separate dimensions and I will make like the slides okay. Then I need to add motion tile. And I'll just add a little bit of camera and blur. Uh, disable the threshold, make it zero. And now blur reduce. Okay, you, can, you can copy my settings to make it a better bit. Graphite. Mm. 
Yeah, that's good now. 